Hey, what's up, Anafinex? Yes, I finally got the Nexus 4. Um, I stayed up so late to, you know, try to get this order because I was hearing about, you know, it being sold out of stock and all that. But I actually got it, you know, in the middle of the afternoon uh, where I live in Central Time. But I finally got it anxiously waiting to unbox this, you know, getting this. And it took one week. Finally, I got it. You know, it shipped. I was so excited last night. Yeah, it's actually shipped within uh, less than 24 hours, which is really crazy, Um, even by my standards. Because I did pay for two-day shipping, which was the standard uh, shipping method. But let's go ahead and unbox this bad boy. Um, let's just take a quick look around the outer, and then we'll look into the inside. And we'll obviously uh, look at the phone in a pretty good uh, depth. So obviously you got the nice clean Nexus logo, and you got the Nexus 7, or Gal Nexus 4, I'm so sorry. <laughs> Nexus 4 right there. Obviously just like every other packaging you've probably seen lately. Um, Nexus 4, and then you got LG right there, very small. And on the back, you got, you know, best of Google, beyond smart, totally wireless, which is awesome. You got, you know, all the, you know, important stuff right there. So, and you got the Nexus 4 right there. And on uh, bottom is, you know, my important information and all that. So, let's, un you know, just slide it off. It's just a sleeve, just like every other box. And there you go. You got the um, usual matte black box and um, Google is notorious known for a uh, really tough tape for this so let's see if they still did, uh, stay up to the standards for that so let's just take out my knife and when I was about oh it's actually oh yeah they improved it a lot it's a lot e much easier to do uh, all right there we go very very easy to do let's just uh, slide this boy out there you go nothing on the inside right there we'll keep that to the side for now oh my just Beautiful right there as you can see new Nexus 4 made by LG. This looks crazy good. Oh my gosh Okay, we, we're gonna have to set this side um, on the side for now I really wish I didn't have to do that, but we have to look in the inside for now But we'll get right back to it pretty quickly. So you just got it back. You know got the model number It's all empty right here And then obviously you got your onboarding warranty information and all that as well So you, you know got warranty rights here Little package. Obviously, no one wants to read that. We'll toss that to the side for now. And then you got, you know, obviously micro USB cable, which is awesome. Micro USB cable is coming more and more popular each and every day, and it's much more universal than uh, those other uh, um, connectors. And then you have got the LG um, cable uh, connector as well. Uh, but you should be able to use your Galaxy Nexus connector as well. Uh, I would just uh, definitely just read into it the DC and uh, out input and output just to make sure. But it should be fine. But definitely just uh, look in deeper. Take a look, um, deeper look into that before you do try it. And you also got a little pin for SIM card right there as well. So let's just set all this to the side and then we'll take a look at the um, main attraction. So let's just, let me just put this back all in, you know, put it all nice and clean. And now let's look at the phone, which is going to be really, really amazing. And uh, my um, early experiences with unboxings, not the, um, when I was watching videos on YouTube, they're not, um, LG um, has so many places where they have plastic. So we're going to have to look pretty hard to get rid of all the plastic. But we'll do that later. So let's just take it off the screen. And this is my favorite part. I think all the screen feels so good. Oh yeah. Just beautiful. And there you go. Oh yeah. And then there there should be one on the back. Somewhere. It doesn't look. Oh yes there is. It's a lot thicker. You know what? We'll save that for later. Um, Let's just let's take a quick look at that. Because you're probably just anxious looking around it. And all that. And let me tell you one thing right off the start. It, lo it feels really really great on my hand. Because it's a nice rubber side. Um, no other phone, I don't think, as, as um, my experience, it has this nice rubber grip. And I think this is really great, especially for the average person uh, who uh, drops this a lot. Um, really, really nice grip. I'm telling you, really nice quality. Great build quality. And as you can see right there, you got little, um, gl uh, little you know, um, specs, I guess you could call it, of the little gems, you could say. And it looks really nice. It brings a nice touch to it. And it will only show up when you get a uh, perfect light. So let's take a look around it. The top is obviously a 3.5 millimeter headphone jack, and you have a little uh, microphone right there. Um, on the left side, you got uh, volume up and down rockers and the SIM card. Um, keep in mind, this is not a removable battery. It doesn't have a removable back cover. And on the bottom, you have a micro USB port. Um, two screws, which are very surprising because usually nowadays these smartphones, a lot of smartphones, don't even show the screws anymore. And you obviously got a microphone there. So two screws, micro USB, and microphone. And on the right side, you just have your power button and everything else is cleaned up. Uh, back is 8mm camera and um, flash as well. And you have a little LG logo right there. And we're going to peel this off now. We're going to try to attempt to peel it off. There we go. Let's peel that bad boy off. There you go. Now you can get a nice clean look at that. 
very very nice uh, I, I love it because both sides are covered with gorilla glass 2.0 so both are covered very well by the latest um technology in um uh, foam protection for your glass back and front so let's power this bad boy on let's take a look at it oh also i forgot to mention um it is software keys so there's no keys at the bottom and you also have a camera up here and sensors and all that as well and so let's get started and speaker up there as well it's powered on it's bad boy Oh yeah, oh, I actually like that vibration. It was very subtle, but it was really nice. I like that vibration. I like it. So I'm gonna let this start up. Let's actually wait till uh, you get to the boot animation. There you go, boot animation. So I'll be right back after this. I'll set up my email and then we'll take a look into it. I'll be right back. All right, I just finished setting it up. So let's go ahead and I'll hit okay. And before we do get started, I'm gonna raise the brightness just for you guys, just so you can get a better look at this. So let's head down to settings first. And you obviously have these on little tiles now because that is running on 4.2 Jellybean. And obviously the latest and greatest Android version. So let's head down to brightness. Let's get rid of that. And okay, so you should be able to see a lot better now. And right away, when I was typing in my email and all that, uh, when, you know when you usually type for a sock, you get a vibration. Well, with the, what LG did was they made it a lot more soft of vibration while you could feel it. Um, I don't I don't really know how to explain it. Um, it's just you have to experience it, and I really do think you'll love it. I, me personally, I really do love this new type of vibration. Very, very different from every other phone I've had, and it works. It's really nice in a soft vibration, which is really nice. Not nothing like you know, hardcore. <laughs> hardcore. <laughs> um, I really don't want to explain it, but if you get a chance to try an X Nexus 4, definitely uh, pay attention to the vibration. You'll love it. So as you can see, the uh, the darks, the colors are very, very dark and very deep. Display is excellent in my opinion. Very, very good. I love it. Um, obviously, this is just an unboxing video, so I'm not going to get in depth with it. I just want to uh, state my opinions. V uh, boots up very quickly. Um, very, very smooth. And uh, the uh, colors are very, very bright. And um, you can see them very clearly. And it works very well. Um, I actually really do love this phone. This is going to be my new uh, daily phone now. I'm going to be using it. I obviously have the, um, the uh, Nexus 4 right here with me. So we'll just do a quick comparison um, with it. So you can see um, both of them side by side. Uh, let's put them on top of each other and you can see the difference. Home buttons are almost in the same place. You got the little, you know, you don't have the little um, dock connector for that. And the bottom, obviously both micro SD card. And you have the um, headphone jack for the Nexus 4 on the top. Two screws instead. And uh, volume rockers, about the same place. You got SIM card here instead. And on the top is a uh, 3.5mm uh, jack while this is just a clean and as you can see, it gets um, it has a curved design while the Nexus 4 doesn't have the curved design. Um, they did change this because the Nexus 4 or the uh, ne Galaxy Nexus was made for talking. That's why it's curved. But now the LG Nexus uh, 4, they decided to make it because more people are going to be gaming and all that instead of talking. Obviously, just because as long as technology is rolling out uh, very quickly. So um, that's about it, guys. Um, very very good. Um, I actually, the, my favorite part about this is probably the nice rubber and the back. I really love it. Um, Really great, uh, no slip at all, very good grip. Um, that's about it guys, don't forget to hit that subscribe button right up there as well, and give me a big old thumbs up in the, um, right there on the top left and or top left corner and bottom left corner as well. Um, I will obviously be doing ruining videos, clock on my recovery, RAM reviews, the whole shebang for both Mac and Windows, so definitely subscribe so you can be notified when I upload those videos very, very soon, um, especially while Thanksgiving break is uh, about to come at, as well. And also don't forget to check my friend, the Diaz, T-H-A-D-I-A-Z-Z-Z, -Z -Z, three Z's. Um, you can check the annotation right there to check out his channel. Um, he just started his uh, gaming channel, and probably many of you people are interested in gaming. So definitely check out his channel um, for gaming videos. He just started up. Uh, give him a lot of support. You know, subscribe to him. I'll do all those good things. Um, and that's about it, guys. Check out his channel. I also have uh, links below to check out his channel as well. Thanks for watching, guys. And don't forget to follow me, add me, and like me on Twitter, Facebook, and Google+. Those are also excellent ways to get in contact with me. Thanks for watching, guys.